the nationalist one. How exciting and new. We're basically a huge ass mountain of a nation. So these mountaineers will really help us defend and even push in some places. So we'll definitely need them, of course, it's just a one-time thing. Um, let's see, well, alright. Let's prioritize these guys. We're finishing upgrading. Now I will not join any war against China right now because unless Japan is oh I didn't I didn't notice that Well, let's get some paratroopers. We'll need them later on. Um, let's see what our industry demands us to get. You know what? Oh, I do not have. I'll. Go with this, but not right now. You know what? Le yeah, let's get some radios. We have fourteen planes. That's okay, I guess. Let them train. Paramilitarism. Now we start building a second line of defense. Or basically a second Level 2 bunkers. We need those. I think I'd feel safe if I have like level 5 bunkers over here. Alright, let's get... Like as many divisions as we can grab from these. I want at least one decent army formed, 24 divisions just across the land. Now, this. Area will be mostly covered by the mountaineers. Well, these uh, our infantry and our one they are suffering from attrition. Second, the logistics we need more artillery, apparently. So let's focus more on these. In a day, this will be upgraded. Let's just keep getting as much fighters as we can, and must we have like I don't know, like 50? We can stop now. Playing as the bet is a bit trickier than playing as Ireland, where Ireland is basically an Ireland 
an island. <laughs> an island. Ireland is basically an island. Which means... Yes, I, I do want... Yeah, I do want this. Which means it can be defended. Like, the only way to get into Ireland successfully is... Either by controlling Dublin or Belfast. And during... My playthrough... Like, I know I couldn't... I'm a shit hard Fire 4 player, I know that, but... I know I couldn't... Uh, take the fight to Britain. Like, I did try... Take over Scotland... And one time I did reach Northern England... Tried to push a little bit... But that was it. I, I do not have the naval capacity... To do it. But, um, I managed to defend against so many naval invasions by just laying mines around Ireland, fortifying the two ports I have, and leaving our enemies to die from hunger, I guess. No, I could have jumped to take over Denmark, uh, take over Iceland and the Faroe Islands. Huh. That would have been a nice base of operation. But, meh. So How is Japan is doing? They are... Still not doing so good up in the north, but they did manage to cut these guys off and oh all right. So once they reach Zhangzi, I think I'll join. I'll join when And we have mountaineers, all right. Let's get a new guy and start trading. Now let's keep them all in one tile. Yes, let's let them train for a little bit. All right, all right, all right. Easy peasy. So let's get the improved artillery. Um, we don't need, we do not need the marines. Ninety thirty nine. Yeah, let's get better mountain infantry. We need radars. Yeah, why not? Let's just get them out of the way. I cannot train any of these. But later on, I will be able to. Um, now, checking on, on our construction, it's going decent. Once I have like level 5 forts, it'll be, be all better. Um, let's get the cavalry guy. Ideological fanatism. will be good for later on now we finish this uh, we jump directly back to the industrial segment need more construction uh, need more civilian factories than military factories of course need to build up our infrastructure level Now let's get at least five motorized divisions. It'll be basically like six, which is good. It's fairly good. Also, it's it on one. Now these guys will will not be a part of this army. 
I'll just this army will be basically for infantry. Now let's give them training. Why not? This army is basically for infantry. Only having this for a little bit of support. This army will be basically on this border and on this border. The mountaineers, the eight mountaineers, will hold these three tiles. And the armored divisions would be for support because they'll be faster than normal troops to counter any infiltrations, I'd like to call them. So let's cut 21 more, merge them. 41, I still need 8. Let's check our logistics. Well, once we have civilian factories, we can get steel. But at least we are stockpiling. A losing stockpile. Oh shit, alright. Let's see this. Yeah, it's not going good for the artillery. I have no problem. Absolutely no problem. Let's continue. Let's just continue cleaning up. I mean, we're basically relying on Japan. So, okay, Japan is going on the offensive. Once I have 24 divisions in this army, I will be ready to make a move. about this all right now let's get everyone into their positions as we prepare to fight Oh, Chinese troops, don't you think you have more important stuff than us? Alright, so our goals from this war are just grabbing Zikang. Just We just need this. Oh, when did we finish this? Alright, we need to get better factory equipment. Um... Yes, why not? Start working on the industry. Oh, we do have transport planes, alright. Now forget about fighters for now. More infantry equipment are needed. You know what? Less infantry equipment. We need more uh, artillery. Okay, you guys stop training. You're gaining attrition. I do not like it. We need to build up some infrastructure.
Right. Now you're 15. It to get you to 24. So I got just like. Let's like put you all over the place. Until we have enough. How many divisions do we need? We need 24, so... We need 9 divisions. 9 infantry divisions. Now, forget about Bhutan and Nepal for a while. We do not need them. Need them later on when we want to oh, take over India, but for now let's just focus on these areas. This is not good, not good at all. Alright. Shit. 